YouTube, how are you? Today I'm going to do two classics, really nice perfumes. First of all, I do Abbey Rouge from Guerlain, that's this one. And then I will come to another favorite of mine, it's Puranom from the house of De Caron in Paris. And these are two classic perfumes that should be considered to be in your collection if you like classic perfumes because I think they're beautiful and I'll tell you why first of all I go to Abbey Rouge Abbey Rouge from Guerlain is a fragrance from 1965 and it's recomposed in 2003 I only know Eau de Toilette and for me it's fine and I will tell you what I think about it well for me this is the Chanel 5 for men it's very powdery in the opening it is a smoky leather citrus scent the name comes from this old horseback riding leather red jackets that people were wearing I think in France when they were going to hunt leather jackets this yeah, you could say smoky tobacco with citrus, bergamot, lime, and there are also flowers in it. And there's also a really oriental, balsamic kind of note in it. It opens really powdery. For me, it's like a sweet, sour incense fragrance when it opens. And then it gets a lot of flowers, rose, jasmine and finally there's also vanilla in it so a little bit sweet it is a real classic scent a very masculine scent if you have something really official that you have to do or if there is like an official occasion just only put two sprays on you or only one don't overdo this on special occasions and when you want to be really classic well i don't like so much powdery uh, fragrances I'll just get one powdery fragrance for women. This is the most powdery fragrance for women that exists, I think. I mean, it's one of the most beautiful ones. It's from my girlfriend. It's the ultimate powdery fragrance. And um, But for men, this is a really great classic fragrance at least uh, worth trying and well I think it has to be in uh, in your collection and when you smell this you go to another time you're in a movie you're in an old French movie you're walking through Paris you're surrounded by little shops bakeries you see classic men you see Parisiennes you can also smell a horse stable People coming out with dressed up in this red leather jackets, coming back from a hunt, and well, it's beautiful. Then the second one, it is Pour un homme de Caron, this one. This is a scent that really surprised me. It's not expensive at all. It is beautiful. It opens yeah, with lavender. Of course, it's the ultimate lavender fragrance, but it changes, it changes totally after a while. In a few hours, this fragrance transforms into a beautiful sugary vanilla surrounded with a little bit of lavender. It was before the Second World War that this guy who made this, this Jewish guy, he had to escape Paris and he went to the United States. He never officially returned to France, but he made this fragrance in the 30s. And it's one of the most beautiful lavender vanilla fragrance that I know. And it transforms from this lavender into a beautiful sugary vanilla with some musk. I have to say this is really one of the, my favorite 
fragrances all time. I don't know why, but it's so beautiful because it's so simple actually, and at the same time, it is so classy, and it's not for old men at all. It is not especially for young men or old men. It's just a beautiful fragrance that you wear on a normal day and just when you have something easy going on it's a nice fragrance and um, maybe it's not a fragrance that you put on just because you want to attract people but just because of the beauty of it it's the same when you smell lavender I'm not a really big lavender only fan but packed with this vanilla together it's so beautiful and uh, well well in one or two hundred years people will still like this perfume it's a classic one I think this fragrance will stay with us forever and um, well you have to try it and don't go from the opening because it changes totally and uh, let me know what you think of it I think it's beautiful so these are two of my classics I like them they're beautiful and uh, well try them if you like them buy them I'll be off for a few weeks I go to Egypt for some diving well thanks for watching and till next time <music>